Robert Forreston was born in Robert Forreston Aitken on the 25th of January 1929 and died on the 21st of October 2018. He was a British-born French academic and Holocaust denier. After the passing of the Gay Sot Act against Holocaust denial in 1990, Forreston was prosecuted and fined, and in 1991 he was dismissed from his academic post. Forreston is believed to be one of seven children born in Shepperton, Middlesex, England to a French father and a Scottish mother. He studied French, Latin and Greek literature, lettre classiques, and passed the aggregation, the highest competitive examination to qualify to be a secondary school teacher, in 1956. He became a high school teacher at Vichy, while working on a PhD thesis about the poet Lautremont. He obtained his doctorate in 1972. He then became a lecturer, and then professor of French literature at the University of Lyon between 1973 and 1990. In Vichy, as a young teacher, he gained attention when he published an interpretation of Rimbaud's sonnet Des Voiles, F.R., as an erotic text. Around 1960, he developed political sympathies for the colonialist cause in Algeria, the Algerie Francaise movement, and was arrested in the belief he was a member of the OAS, a terrorist organization. These assertions were based on his own interpretation of archival records and his skepticism about the assertions and testimony of various historical figures, including Nazi officials such as Rudolf Hoss. He became involved with the Institute for Historical Review during the 1970s, lecturing and publishing prolifically. He twice testified in defense of Canadian-German Holocaust denier Ernst Zundel, and his testimony has been associated with laying the groundwork for the Lukta Report, an influential Holocaust denial publication. Forreston's activism garnered him several dedicated critics including the Jewish-French historian Pierre vidal Naki. Forreston interviewed Otto Frank in researching the article, though much of what Forreston asserted Frank had said was later contradicted by Frank himself. Forreston's writing on the subject first came into the spotlight during a court case between Otto Frank and Heinz Roth, a publishing house owner responsible for the circulation of various neo-Nazi writings including several publications impugning the authenticity of Van Frank's diary. Forreston's writing on the subject was entered into the court record as an expert opinion in defense of Roth. The 1978 finding of the court was that Roth must refrain from publishing any further reading material claiming the diary was a fraud. Iranian President Mahmoud Ahmadinejad granted Forreston an award for courage in Tehran. Iran on 2 February 2012. Shortly after the Gay Sot Act, a statute passed that prohibited Holocaust denial, was enacted in 1990. Forreston was convicted of Holocaust denial in a French court. In 1991, Forreston was removed from his university chair. He challenged the statute as a violation of international law at the International Government on Civil and Political Rights and Human Rights Committee. Forreston filed a complaint with the United Nations Human Rights Committee in 1993. In 1996, the committee rejected Forreston's claim that France's prosecution of him was a violation of the first optional protocol to the International Government on Civil and Political Rights. The committee upheld the Gay Sot Act as necessary to counter possible anti-Semitism. Further trials followed, among them, one in connection with the publication on the website of the Association des Anciens Amateurs de Recettes de Guerre et de la Coste, R, in 1998, of which he was absolved due to lack of evidence of his authorship. In 1991, Forreston was removed from his university chair on the basis of his views under the Gay Sot Act. He challenged the statute as Forreston was charged again in a trial on the 11th of July 2006. He was accused of denying the Holocaust in an interview with the Iranian television station Sahar One in February 2005. On 3 October 2006, he was given a three-month probationary sentence and fined €7,500 for this offense. In December 2006, 
Forreston gave a speech at the International Conference to review the global vision of the Holocaust, which was sponsored by the government of Iran. Beginning in late 2008, Forreston became close to the comedian and political activist Daedon Balambella, appearing with him publicly on stage and in video, and celebrating his, Forreston's, 80th birthday in his theater. Die Don awarded Robert Forreston an insolent outcast prize. The award was presented by one of Die Don's assistants, Jackie, dressed in a concentration camp uniform with a yellow badge. This earned Die Don a court conviction. He died at 89 years old.